And then that tongue should fit snugly in that style, and it does. And so that's that will be your finished product for your door. And you can see that tongue should extend the full depth as well. And then when you glue that, it forms a T. It, it's very, very durable and stable. And then we can do a little dog obedience training. <whistles> Molly, heel, Rusty, heel. Sit. Sit. Heel. Release. See that, Alicia? Consistency. So we've got our carcass done, and I made some caps that I'm going to make a little thinner. They go underneath and on top like so. Now our styles cut. What we want to do is make sure that the action of the box works. That we can lift it up and pull it out and get it out. And we can't. So we're going to make this a little shorter. Ah, perfection. What do you know? Trial and error. You can't beat trial and error. So we'll repeat that same process now that we did with the uh, exterior carcass. A dab of glue, nail it together, and then we'll cut the plywood to fit. Don't forget, Aunt Sandy, this is supposed to be handed down to Alicia as an apology for all of the abuse that I put her through as a young child. I still feel she's adopted, and I wish you guys would just own up to that, but that's between you guys. And deja vu. We do the same thing we did before. It fits. The plywood squares up the box. So we'll glue the, the rabbit and shoot the plywood. Okay, so our, our silverware box is done, and I think what we'll do, because your silverware has ornate carvings from top to bottom, we don't want to sit it into pockets where, you, where those disappear. So I think the silverware will be laid out, and there will be an arm that comes down and locks them in with velvet on one side. So the box fits in, like so and we need to attach the caps top and bottom. So the next step, we'll attach the caps. I think we're gonna dowel these. You 
punch the hole. You fill the hole with glue. Tap the dowel in. And then cut the dowel flush. Hammer that. And then sand. So we have everything done now. We have pieced the doors together. You see how that fits? Put those together. We will make it so that these overlap when they close, and we'll order the glass, and we'll on. That's what she's going to look like.